I gotta make a whole new roll. No sushi. We're done with Asian cuisine in this food truck. No. Hey everyone, what's going on? Jeff here and welcome back to Food Truck Simulator. It's been a, about a month since I've last played this from the last episode. So I don't remember too much about what happened beforehand. But uh, our job right now is to install a new device called the rice cooker. I think I, I think I still need to buy it. I'm not sure. I know we got burned down. I know we had problems with Dennis and stuff like that. And I think at the last one we did, we did food at the docks, if I'm not mistaken. But upgrades. Hopefully I know kind of what I'm doing. Uh, rice cooker. Sure. Upgrade your shelves to level two. So shelving. Uh, there we go. So time to take a rest, just like Clara said. <laughs> okay, apparently Clara said to go take a rest. Sure. Nighty night world. Oh man, I do love how that's uh the voices and stuff for the voice actors. Oh, hello, Clara. Hey, kid. Looks like you've spread your name around town, don't you? Hi, Clara. Thanks. Took a lot of hard work. I think it might be the right time to diversify your kitchen. What do you think? Why not? The world belongs to the brave. Perfect. I think there is one person that can help. A legendary chef who retired from a big name business. He runs a store in the Asian district now. Sounds interesting. You'll need to speak with him personally. He is known as Mr. Hurricane. Ooh, I like Almost it. Nobody calls him by his real name anymore. Hurricane? Sounds like he's some sort of superhero. <laughs> Honestly, kid, he's nothing short of that in the kitchen. It's well earned. Fair enough. His shop is located close to the beach. Actually, it's the third street from the beach. Got it. He always stays behind the window on the ground floor. Just be yourself, and I'm sure it'll go smoothly. Great. And as always, thank you, Clara. Keeping my fingers crossed. Okay, Clara. Thanks for the help. Uh, where do we need to go? I already forgot. Reach the Asian district. Oh, it's just straight ahead. It's just past Clara's. Okay. Whoops. K kind of remembering a little bit about this game. Uh, I was actually having some thoughts on it the other day because I joined the Drago Entertainment Discord. And it would be so cool. Oh, look at the little balloon. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean, didn't mean to never on you there. It would be so cool if you could actually have like different food trucks for different cuisines. Like maybe you want to do Mexican food. Uh, that would be kind of... Go ahead. Make your, make your right turn. It would be so cool if you could have like different cuisines. Like maybe an Italian food truck. Maybe a Mexican food truck. Maybe an Asian food truck. Just to have your like specialties in different trucks instead of doing everything on the same truck. I think that would be a really cool idea. Oh, we're over to the Asian district. Let's go. Uh, where am I going over here though? I'm here. Can I just drive over here? Okay. I'm about to meet a real kitchen star. Oh, he's over there. Need to be calm. Excuse me. Ooh, almost hit you. Uh, just gonna squeeze through that. Oh, nobody can tap this driving. Never mind. I was gonna say no one can tap this driving skill, but apparently I hit that wall there. Mr. Haro, can closer. The shop has to be near. That's right here. You're going to teach me how to do rice? Other Asian food? Uh, oh, E. There we go. Wanted to make sure I did a good parking job. Ooh. Ooh, a dragon. Oh, yeah. We're going to be making some fish. Oh, we're, we're not allowed to see your face. Hello, young man. I was expecting you'd show up at my doorstep sooner or later. Oh. Hello. How did you know? Once someone has mounted a tiger, it will not come off it anymore. I knew you would not stop huh. after all the recent successes. I'm just trying to do my best. That's what one should always do in life. So, Very true. Now you've come to me so I could teach you. Yes. 
I want to learn. It has been a long time since I have taught anyone. I retired years ago, but I could make an exception. Really? Why? I met someone here as passionate about the kitchen as I was. If not for him, I would likely not run this store and waste away in my home. And you have his face. Wait, my face? You don't mean... Your father. Oh. Connor was a good friend of mine and a very good chef as well. He might no longer be with us, but here you stand. And I can see you're just as enthusiastic about cooking as he was. So, I'll teach you. What a small world. I mean, thank you, Sensei. <laughs> Sensei, you really are just like your father. Now, you'll need to buy all necessary products so we can start cooking. Let's start our cooperation. All of these products Ooh. are extremely important for our lessons. So get one of these. Uh, 12 rice boxes. 12. Uh, 12, 12, 12. 12 basic nori. 12 of the spiced nori. So we're going to be making sushi and stuff, right? Tuna, salmon, yeah, that's what it looks like. I tried uh, sushi before in... Not, not a fan. And then we need one more chili. Now uh, sorry. to the Chinatown selling spot. We'll speak when you arrive. And okay. keep my eye on you as you work. Yes, Sensei. Now, sushi, it's actually been quite a few years since I tried it. I do want to kind of give it another go. Just to try it again. I go... <laughs> Probably not the best place to get it, but I go to Kroger a lot and they do sushi and I see it all the time and I, I always think about trying. I might try it again though. We'll see. If you like sushi, let me know. I love to, love to hear what your thoughts on sushi are. Or other Asian cuisines. Dancing Dragon. We're serving Asian food with french fries on top of our truck. That's not the best placement. Hello. So, young man, are you ready to accept your sensei's teachings? Yes, sensei. Then for the first step, put the rice into your new cooker. Okay. All right, so I was actually worried. I don't know how the music's going to be with YouTube and stuff, but, you know, we'll, we'll try it. Can't make it fits. We're in Asian town. Uh, or Chinatown. Asian district, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, pull out the rice cooker drawer. Right here. There we go. Oh, it's down below the fries. Okay, oven. I'll put rice into the cooker. It's in. Now you can switch it on with the red button. There we go. A uh, red button. Okay, the rice is cooking. For the best quality rice. Okay. You need to cook it to the precise desired state. Right now, oh. you can place the nori leaf on your assembly table. When the rice is ready, put it on the leaf. Got it. More haste, less speed. Or how you put it, slow and steady wins the race. Also, you can already prepare the sushi box. And for the last step... Oh, you're giving me so much! You have everything prepared. You can put wasabi and soy sauce into the sauce stand. Yes, Sensei. Okay. Uh, uh, you, you, you guys are giving me way too much to, to do right now. So our boxes are over here. Let's put, let's put the sushi box baby steps. Now place the nori on the assembly table. Jeremy Capio. Wasabi sauce. Where would the wasabi sauce be? Would that be in the fridge? Tuna, salmon, shinko. Where the hell is the spice nori at? Oh, we got the basic nori in here. There's no spice nori though. Oh, wow. It looks exactly the same as basic nori. 
Uh, put the wasabi sauce into the thing, and it's the wasabi too. There we go, nice. Uh, into the put wasabi and soy sauce. Oh, wasabi too. Okay. Uh, where's the wasabi? Soy sauce. There we go. And place the soft rice on the nori. Everything is ready. Good. Very good. Now Same take slice. out the salmon from the fridge and cut it into slices. After that, you place one slice on the rice. Okay. So sounds simple enough. Okay. So. Let's put you right there. What now? Now do the exact same. But with an avocado. Unfortunately. Okay. It, w it, w it wasn't letting me pick up them, them up, so I'm just going to put them all right there. There we go. Uh, you want avocado? Sounds good. This actually does sound very good. There we go. You want two of those. Now it's time to roll the sushi. It's a very important step affecting the shape of the roll. Well rolled sushi gives you a greater opportunity to cut it into more pieces. Remember, don't stop once you begin rolling. Otherwise, it will result in a bad roll. Understood. I have way too much stuff on my desk just to let you know. Press right click to start the rolling machine then move the scroll wheel or S to fill the circle. When the circle is filled, press the space button to complete the roll. You succeeded on the first try. Yeah, I'm, I'm amazing. That is a perfect roll. Well done. Oh, now, whoa. The cutting. Can't wait. If you show proper timing, you will cut the entire roll. I'm going to mess this up so bad. Focus on every next piece and find the right moment to cut the roll. You need Whoa. five pieces of sushi to complete the order. If you can't make five pieces out of this roll, then you'll need to prepare another one. Understood. I'd have to start all over? What? I have to press the button in the right combination for one, two, three, four, five, and six. Oh boy. Um, okay. That puts you over here, right? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was clicking the wrong button. That's why you have to right click to put everything on there. Um, okay. Five, two, two. That practice makes perfect. Oh no! <laughs> I gotta make a whole new roll. No sushi. We're done with Asian cuisine in this food truck. No. Oh my gosh. So I need to get a spicy spicy nori again. At least I have everything ready. Never mind, I need some more rice. Oh boy. Hey, how you guys doing? Oh boy, we got a line out there. So the thing that actually really sucks about this is I'm wasting a lot of food just to make one roll just for one little piece that I need for this. Otherwise, I just, if it wasn't the tutorial, I'd just give it to them. I don't care. At least I'm not wasting, oh, I guess I kind of am wasting everything, Never mind. Uh, start rolling. Okay. Five, four, one, six. Five, four, one, six. Wait, what am I messing up there? Amazing. The good news is that those were the hard parts, young man. Just arrange the cut sushi into the box. Okay. There's one more thing to add. Yes, you are right. There you Pick go. There's your wasabi. wasabi. And add it to the sushi box. It has a special slot there. I am sure you know what to do next. Yes, Sensei. <laughs> yes, Sensei. Oh, I don't like this. Here's your order. Enjoy. Thank you, Sensei. That was brilliant. 
I had no I... idea that I was capable of doing such things. Your father said the same I still don't thing. think I'm capable, but okay. Let's see if you can show consistency as he did. No. Nope. Serve various or different orders until the selling point closes. Okay. So you want some cooked rice? Gotcha. I think I just wasted two boxes. I don't think it serves a full box. Uh, cooked. Uh, what do you want? You just want a basic nori? Okay. There we go. We'll get we'll get a couple boxes out here. There we go. That is cooked. Then you want a salmon, two avocados. Salmon. Two avocados. And then we just gotta roll it and slice it. You don't want no sauce? Okay. That one looks good. Uh, we're just gonna... Actually, I might actually need you guys later. We're just gonna put you guys right there. Spicy, surimi, futaki. Yeah, just in case. Extra slices. Just in It's on the dirt, but whatever. Uh. One, three, three, six. One, three, three, six. One, two, three, four, five. I got it. Hell yeah. Or not. Okay, so I gotta place each one individually. Three, four, five. And I believe two, you are done. Okay. Not too bad. Oh no, you want to sear me. This isn't a sear me. Okay, we'll just leave you there just in case. Excuse me, just in case. Soft rice. There we go. Uh, just gonna get into the box up here. You want soft rice in that? This one you're gonna want. So we need two soft rices. I'm gonna try to get faster at this. Uh, soft, 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 soft. What am I looking for now? Oh yeah, spicy, spicy. So you both want spicy. That's good. And put you there. And spicy. Put you there. Soft. Put you out. There we go. And put you back there. So you want two ceramic slices. What is ceramic? Is that in here? Or is that over here? Right here. Yeah. Uh, that's almost done. I'll just, I'll wait to cook. Uh, yeah, you know I'll do it right now. So interesting, the ceramic is actually in the freezer. Put you right there. Two ceramics, capino. And we just set you on the table, I guess. There we go. one and then wasabi okay we gotta roll you there we go just gotta cut you five five one two five five one two i really do not understand that to be honest I'm not gonna pretend i do to understand it as long as I get my five pieces that I need, we're good. And then you want wasabi. There you go. That is for number three. Have a good day. Uh, soft rice, salmon, avocado. Just as I wanted. 
Avocado. I don't have any more avocado, so we're gonna go over to the fridge. Cut you up. Uh, there we go. Put you there. Two of you. You want two cooked rices for the next one. Oh yeah, I'm I'm getting the hang of it again. It's been a few weeks since I played this game. The Asian cuisine is not too bad. Uh, avocado. You want wasabi? I think that's done for this one. I'm gonna go ahead and get two of you out. There we go. The next one you want two basic noris. Actually, okay, the spicy one is actually have a little bit of a more of a color to it. You're in here. Do the thing I don't want. Six three one six. Six three one six. I don't think I can do it too fast. That's why I'm messing up. But so far so good. We, I'm doing just fine. I think. There we go. And you want wasabi with that one. Order number four, you are up. Have a good day. Oh no. Oh, I burnt the rice. Damn it. I completely forgot about it. Hey, how you guys doing? Uh, soft rice and that's gonna be uh, spicy. Over here. Oh, okay. Yeah, spice is green. This one's like a darkish color. Got it. Both well, are gonna be cooked. Uh, there we go. And that last one's gonna be soft. Okay. Sounds good. It's like uh, waiting for the fries and stuff to cook when you're doing the other thing. Or waiting for the meats to cook. If you want it cooked, there you go. This one is gonna be soft rice. Okay, so you need two cerami slices. For one. And capino. And then you're gonna want soy sauce for that one. And then for this one, you want salmon. Do I have any more salmon? I do. Two avocados. That is soft. Nice. Uh, da da da. Two. Now it's time to wax on, wax off. Wax Every on, wax off. Needs to clean his kitchen after a rush hour. Yes, sensei. Pick up the brush from your tool wheel. Okay, dude, I, ca I can't do that yet. Cooker. Uh, soft rice, you know what? I'll just do it real quick because he wants me to. There you go. Oh, yeah. It actually, it's actually a slow clean process, but we're doing it. Well done. There you go. Now, young man, you can clean all other devices you have used. I'll get to it. We're actually- this place is actually filthy. Six, three, three, three. Okay, that one was actually perfect. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. Uh, put you right here. There we go. You want some soy sauce? Gotcha. How do I... Do I gotta go here? No. Oh, I already did it. I did not notice. Okay. Uh, bring you over here. Five, six, six, five. Five, six, six, five. There we go. And 
And that one you want soy sauce as well. And you are number five. There you go. Nice. I'm actually making quite a bit of money for this too. Uh, two ceramic slices. Oh, I only got one left. Damn. Nice. And then Capio. Just needed to cut one. That's all I'm doing. I have no place to store these either. Now you want some of this. And then wasabi. Okay, yeah, that's not too hard. And uh, then wasabi with this. Ooh, not ketchup. Or, yeah, ketchup. Wasabi, there we go. Kinda curious how I can actually put ketchup on there. There you go. Have a good day, sir. Now I got a clean. Let me get through this. Nice. So that was a waste. Uh, dump oil from. Why do we have oil in the fire machine? Uh, drain. Uh, right here. Come back to my shop. It's time for your sensei to review your performance. Okay. That actually was not too hard. Very, very rough start there. But, not too bad. Uh, I'm coming back. Come back as long as my camera cooperates. Oh, I did not mean to knock that down. Young man, just watching you make me feel alive in the kitchen again. Oh, that's nice. You fulfilled and exceeded my expectations. My pleasure. Now that I'm sure, allow me to give you one gift. Oh, what is it? A unique Santoko knife from Ooh. a Japanese steel. It was made in Okinawa by the old master Hattori. I've made sure to keep it as sharp as I can. Wow. In truth, I had considered giving the knife to your father, but before I'd made up my mind, fortune gave me a second chance. So I want to give it to you. Please take it. Thank okay. you, Sensei. I don't know how I'll pay you back. As any student pays their Sensei back, Continue to hone the skills I taught you. Do everything in yes, your sensei. power. Leave the rest to fate. Sensei, you're a wonderful person. Thank you. On behalf of myself and my father. Goodbye, young man. Hope you visit me again. You'll always find a place to test your sushi-making skills here. I will. Goodbye. So maybe it's time to test myself. Just like Mr. Hurricane said. Oh, so I need to buy a bunch of stuff here. Um, you don't really have any. Uh, I need to just. I do need spicy nori. Uh, just one more. And I order that. Sort. Confirm. Excuse me. No, don't you dare walk in front of me. I was gonna go see if Claire has any pizza door. Do I gotta go all the way to the Italian district? Uh, it doesn't. Oh, you do got everything, Claire. You have pizza dough. Oh, you have mozzarella cheese. And oh, yeah, you do have everything. Cool. Uh, cause I already forgot how to order ahead. I think I gotta do that from my shop or my garage, but I can just order here. So pizza dough, I need two more of those. Uh, one more mozzarella. And then one more bacon. There we go.
Oh, I thought I got everything. I guess I didn't. Bear, I still need ya. Oh, that's a wide turn. Oh, I didn't get the pizza dough. My bad. There we go. And guys, that is actually... We spent the whole episode working on the Asian district, but that's where I'm going to be wrapping up this episode. Next episode, we'll be driving to the beach district to hone our skills and probably do a variety of things, which is why we had to buy all that product just now. I hope you guys are enjoying. Make sure you check out all the socials down below in the description or they just been below my name the, the whole video. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, remember to change that world one smile at a time. You never know whose life you save or change. And as always, I can see you in the next live stream video. Love you guys. Again, thank you for watching. As always, I appreciate you guys more than anything in the world, especially if you made it this far into the video. Up over here, we got your most recommended video just for you. Down over here, make sure you subscribe and come back for more. As always, I can't wait to see you in the next video, and I look forward to reading your comments. Love you guys.